everybody stop because oh shit, did he hit that? Let's do that pushing big wigs in the fast lane. That's the MO fam. Choose that logic from police in a car chase. That's the MO fam. Choose that spinning that mix going hard, mate. That's the MO fam. Like, comment, subscribe. You know the vibe. This is the MO's gang. Don't get gassed. All this chat. Bring your whip. You'll get gaps. You said this and he said that. But no one cares because you ain't bad. It's just facts. You can't be like. Yo guys, what's going on today? I'm doing a day in the life of DMO, well slightly. This video might be something else. Obviously by the title, you already know what the main title of this video is. But I'm filming from early morning. I am on the way to my second base, my second home, after my office, as you all know. I'm always at Madman Mechanics because my manager, Cam, runs Madman Mechanics and I have a station there where I work from. That's where mainly most of the YouTube videos get created from. And today the weather's good so I thought, you know what, I'm gonna work for Madman Mechanics today. I'm not going to my main office. I've got about three or four other businesses that I run which you lot don't have a clue about and you don't even want to know about them because it's nothing exciting. But um, yeah, so we're going to Madman Mechanics. We're gonna be testing out some quad bikes, riding my own quad bike, editing some videos and we're just gonna see what's going on from there. So. Um, yeah, stay tuned. I'm not even gonna, I don't even know what's gonna go on. But just stay tuned and we'll see what happens, whatever happens. Who knows what's gonna happen by the end of the day. Stay tuned, let's go. At Mabba Mechanics. And this is my Mabba Mechanics desk and little station that I work from. It's the big manager cam. Obviously the cold candy is empty. <laughs> and uh, I need to do a little clean up around here. But yeah, this is where I'm working from today. Don't know what's gonna happen after that. I need to get some videos edited with cam. And then I might pop to my other office and see what happens from there. Who knows? Every day I don't even know where I'm going to be. I'll just put it that way. I don't, when I wake up, I don't know if I'm going to be at home, be at Mabba Mechanics, be at my other office, be out and about. I don't know. <laughs> I'll just keep it moving. Stay tuned and let's go. So early morning, first things first. Cam always asked me to test out the quads at Mabba Mechanics just to make sure they're DMO approved. Especially, this is Alfie Best. Um, it's had the self carbon pack. I think he's still got some more little bits to get done. But as, it, as you know, this is a 2020 Raptor and it's not even road registered right now. So he's literally got a few things more that he needs to get done. Um, after it's been done, it will um, come back, get all the graphics done. It's got the bit, uh, MMM carbon speed locks on there. Um, full carbon pack, Acaprovic kit on there. So it's got the Acapulco custom exhaust system, um, bigger A arms, and yeah, so I'm just doing the road test and then I think the driver's gonna send it over to where uh, Alfie is and um, yeah. So just a little road test. Got no fuel, so make sure that I'm back in. This is actually stock at the moment, apart from the exhaust. So it isn't that fast at the moment, but it will be fast when it comes back. So. So quick testing on the BMW double R. Had some more final tweaks on the quad. As you know, I ride super quads a lot, so I can always get my feet testing. Today here at Bamba Mechanics, this is why I've come down here today. This H2R lump is going inside the Raptor. So the guys here have stripped it down and obviously I want to be a part of the build so we're going to come here and help get this in. Also been helping test some quads. Got the NW double R down there. My quad there, Miss Quad there, Miss Quad there. Um, KTM, don't know what's over there. R1M there, 700 frame, 660. So boom, over here we've got Shane, active. You know what he's doing? 
You're building fucking Mist squad again. You know why? Because Mist freights the fuck out of his quads. Freights the fuck out of his quads. So, I think this is his third stage five build. <laughs> I swear to God, you know what the maddest thing is? Is that Mist is the only person to blow up an engine. <laughs> He's the only one, he's the only person to blow up a stage five or any Mamba mechanics, mechanics quad. I don't know what he does, but he rallies his shit, rallies it, and then when it blows, it's like, yo, it's only going fucking 50 mile an hour, thinking, yo, <laughs> he's a madman, but yeah. <laughs> no one can compete with Mist. <laughs> he's a madman. Yo, guys, so it is the day in the life vlog well I don't even know by the title anyway I'm vlogging my day and day so all the testing of Madman Mechanics has been done I am now on the way to my third home which is Deutschtech and I believe that uh, Mist is there with his new whip and um, yeah we're gonna see what happens from there like I said this is just a daily vlog this is shit that I do every day I've got my office at Madman Mechanics and I've got another two offices and um, yeah I also work from Deutsche Tech as well sometimes. Wherever I am, my mobile office is inside. Let me just shut the gate in my mechanics. My mobile office is anywhere. So that's where we're off to right now. We're lit right now. Ryan Taylor with his bad boy AM GT versus the E63S. Let's see what happens. Once you're out of here, there's no point, you're gonna get us nicked. So we couldn't even put that footage in there. Obviously, Ryan was doing a mad thing, nearly whacked up the car and that. <laughs> We're not trying to get any man nicked for snitching. But yeah, anyway, it's probably best that that happened. You can call it as a scapegoat because he would have got the fucking full gaparoni sauce, wrench sauce, bitches with smoke and fucking red ketchup on top of that. So um, yeah, you know what? You're lucky, Ryan. You're lucky. You're lucky because I was ready to gap you so hard. But. Yeah, it's probably better that that happened because then there ain't gonna be no footage of you getting gapped. But anyway, we're gonna go upstairs, jump in the EK9, and then we're gonna go to Jam Sport and see what the situation is with the fuck Fabian van. Moving forward with the van, not we're not chasing Fabian today, we're just gonna move forward with the van and see what we're gonna be doing to it. So stay tuned, let's go. So I had man taking the piss out of my Yeezys. For the real DMO Army supporters, no. I have a dedicated pair of Yeezys out of the 80 pairs that I have that are just for riding and these are the ones that I always have on as you can see it's that black mark there that's 10 w 40 if you know you know that's where I shift up on my quad you see they're rinsed everyone taking a piss I'm just letting you know I've upgraded to the sliders today just to piss you all off alright so you know what time it is let's put these away this is what's going on right now EK29 baby and for all them dickheads that are like yo it's not an EK29 it don't exist y'all know it don't exist I created it yeah and you know why I created it because it's an EK9 it's got a K20 so I put the EK29 together in it <laughs> and supercharge yeah we got MK performance you know what time it is let's talk more shifting let's go let's see if this bitch starts spin since the last vlog that you saw since I've drove it. Sweet as a nut, mate. Are you mad? Come on. I look forward to every day I get to drive this bitch. And you know what? The fuck Stu's coming back this weekend. Let's go. As you know, you already know the vibe when we get inside the EK29. It's fucking
with Jamie now and we are going to talk about the future plans of the fuck Fabian Mobile and um, yeah we need to take it to new heights obviously he's done us over and so we need to show him how it should have been even better we were the best of the game jam sport and Jamie's going to tell us what the plans are moving forward we've obviously spoke about it but he was like we should do this we should do that and I was like yeah 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 if it's possible and he's like yeah of course it is <laughs> so yeah tell us what we're doing well, we, the first thing we need to do is tear it down Okay. Yeah. <laughs> we're dealing with get everything mounted. We've got some big plans, and you know I think we can do some exciting stuff. Really. Um, yeah, mate, it's the van that it should have been. Yeah, it has, it has to more, be, and it has more, to be. So more, yeah. more than it just being a uh, an ST conversion, or then actually then it's a thousand brake and just it runs and it looks nice. Yeah, we'll, we we'll, need to we'll, do. We'll get it done, and we'll we'll do more things. So we've That's got some big do. plans. So, um, are we going to tell them the plan, dude? Or no? no, we'll just do that as we're going along. Okay, okay cool. Yeah. You know, you're going to have to stay tuned then because we're going to just do it and then just say, oh, yeah, and we're doing this and we're doing that. And trust me when I say you're going to be surprised. I was surprised and I was even like, off the camera, like, is that even possible? <laughs> and it's like, yeah. I was like, oh my God, this is going to be mad. So, yeah, stay tuned. Come on. Man had to come back and shut it down. We're in Brom. We got bored, so we thought, yeah, we might as well come here. Let's see what the tracks are saying. Let's go back to the roots. Come on, all of the petrol head stuff started from here. Let's see what's popping, innit? Obviously, we didn't put out an announcement because you know what happened last time. But then we go to different cities, 20,000 people want to turn up. So we just pulled up and see what happened. But obviously, let's see if the gang come out. But I'm not going to put a proposal still. Stay tuned. Just a daily vlog. Let's go. Is nuts, is bonkers. 